Hi there, today we are going to learn about Brave Shields. Brave Shields allow for a faster and more private browsing experience by blocking ads, trackers, and more. To demonstrate how Shields work, let's navigate to a website. I'm going to go to tmz.com. The Shields button, represented by a little lion icon, can be found on the top right hand side of your browser. When you click on it, a panel will pop up. As you can see, my Shields are up. Brave Shields are on by default, but you can put them down at any time you like. At the top of the dashboard, I can see that a whopping 32 ads and trackers have been blocked on this site. There are also nine HTTPS upgrades. You can actually click on each of these figures to expand them for a list of the particular elements that were either blocked or upgraded. Below that, you have your advanced controls. Here you can control ad blocking. You can choose to let all ads and trackers through or to see none at all. To the right of the ads control menu, you have your cookie control menu, where you can choose either chocolate chip cookies, macadamia nut cookies, or <laughs> just kidding. You can either allow cookies or block all cookies or block only third party cookies. Below you can find similar options for fingerprinting protection as well as several other toggles. It's important to note that this particular dashboard is site specific. If you look at the top left here, you can see that it says site shield settings for tmz.com. To edit your global default shield settings, click the text at the bottom here to open up your shield settings in browser preferences. Here, you can find the same options we just covered, but changes to these settings will apply to all sites. Last thing, if you navigate to a site where your shields are up and you notice that it isn't loading properly because the site depends on various scripts or cookies, you can try turning off your shields panel or playing with some of the controls. That'll usually get you back up and running. I hope you found this helpful and thanks for watching.